Hello friends, welcome to our channel Google Galaxy. Today we are going to talk about the law of multiple proportion. We know that there the smallest portion of matter is atom. Everything around us is made up of atoms. When the atoms of same or different elements combine, they form molecule. And the chemical reactions involve both atom as well as molecules. Since the 17th century, the scientists were trying to establish the basis of these chemical combination. Ultimately, they derived out with the five laws. Out of those five laws, we are discussing the our third law. We have already published our two video. You can search on our channel and watch them. And the third law, we are having the law of multiple proportion. This law was proposed by the Johann Dalton sir. Johann Dalton sir. The first three laws, we, uh, the law of conservation of mass, law of constant composition, and the law of multiple proportion, is about the chemical deals with the mass during the chemical reaction. This law states that when the two elements combine to form two or more than two different compounds, then the different masses of one element which combine with the fixed mass of other element bears the simple ratio. Okay, this is the whole definition we have already read in our books it becomes complicated for us let's talk about the simple thing i'll give you an example that the carbon and the oxygen we are having the carbon and oxygen let's talk about the two compound formed by the carbon and the oxygen the carbon forms two oxide in oxygen we are having the carbon monoxide carbon monoxide this one is the let's take take an example that carbon monoxide we say when the carbon having the mass number 12 and the oxygen to balance it we have just balanced in another way we have just cancel it out these two it becomes the carbon monoxide so overall mass of oxygen will be 16 Another type of oxide formed by the carbon is carbon oxide, carbon dioxide. When we mix the, these two, it, it forms the CO2. But we see, what does this law say that, what does Johan Dalton say that, that the, if we, uh, the, that the ratio of mass of oxygen that the ratio of mass of oxygen, carbon monoxide and carbon dioxide for fixed mass of carbon for fixed mass of carbon we have already fixed the mass the mass of carbon bears the simple ratio we are having the ratio of mass of oxygen in carbon monoxide and the mass of oxygen in carbon dioxide they bears the simple ratio 16 divided by 32 it will always become one ratio 2 we say it bears simple ratio to one another this is whole about the law of multiple proportion